Hi folks, T-Hawk with Backcountry Rag Bagging. Today I'm going to show you how to make your own sweet pickle relish for recipes that may call for sweet relish. We all know that the relish that you buy in stores is not keto friendly, so today we're going to attempt to make our own sweet relish out of dill pickles and a food processor. Alright, let's get to it. Alright, first you're going to need some sort of dill pickle. I'm using these hamburger chips that I got from Aldi's. Alright. Be sure to get a little bit of the dill juice in there. And uh, you can make as much or as little relish as you want with this recipe. <laughs> it's so simple. It's only uh, two ingredients. The uh, pickles and the sweetener. All right, so next we're going to take some of this stevia and monk fruit blend. This is some really sweet and good stuff. I use it all the time in uh, different things, but uh, I really like the taste of this uh, liquid sweetener. But you could use whatever liquid sweetener you have, but I highly recommend this stevia monk fruit blend. It is uh, the perfect combination of sweetness. Next, we're just going to... Give about three or four good squirts in there. And then we're just gonna hit the chop button. Give it about three good pulses to make sure it's all mixed and incorporated. Yeah, that looks good. And there's the final product. And we're just gonna give it a, a little tiny taste test to make sure it's all blended well. Ooh, look at that folks. That's amazing. All right, so. That is spot on sweet pickle relish. It still has a little tartness from the deal, but uh, there's enough sweetness in there to uh, compare it to store-bought uh, pickle relish that you make with uh, sugar. I really like it. I think it's good. And you should give it a try for yourself, especially if you got any recipes that call for sweet pickles. Uh, these would go great in uh, deviled eggs. Oh my God. That'll go great in deviled eggs. I got to make some deviled eggs now. <laughs> but uh, there you have it, folks. Uh, easy, simple, uh, sweet pickle relish. Now you could add pimentos to that if you want. Uh, we don't care for the pimentos too much. They don't bother us. We'll eat them if they're in there, but uh, definitely like it without it if I'm going to make my own pickle relish. This is uh, very delicious. I hope you try it. Okay, folks, so I'd like to just add real quick that this sweet pickle relish was spot on sweet pickle relish goodness. Now... <clears throat> Yeah, you can just always go with dill uh, in keto and low carb recipes, but you know it just doesn't replace the uh, flavor of that sweet pickle relish like this. What I just came up with does. Um, just had an idea in my head, figured I'd give it a try, and to me, it's a outstanding success. If you like this video and you want to check out some of my other videos, be sure to like and subscribe hit the bell notification for more videos as I put them out again thanks for watching see you next time T-Hawk out